What's up guys, it's Cody coming back at you with another video from the ADHD Projects channel and today I wanted to give you guys a little bit of a review on something that I bought a while ago for my 7.3 and that is this little tiny Amazon solar, pow uh, solar panel, okay? This is a trickle charger solar panel that I got off of Amazon a while back. I think it was, it was about six months ago that I got that uh, solar panel trickle charger and I never really did like a full video on it. I did mention it in one of my videos and kind of go over it with you guys. But now that I've had it for about six months, I want to go over it with you guys a little more about it. Uh, really tell you guys my opinion on it, give you a little review on if I think it works or not and stuff like that. Uh, so let's go and get right into it. First of all, let me show you guys how I have it set up in the truck. So basically this trickle charger comes with just these suction cup uh, little things, they, these little suction cups that go in here and just suction cup to your windshield. Now those honestly did not work very well. The uh, solar panel would kind of fall off sometimes while I was driving. So I didn't really like that, uh, but it was a super easy fix. I just basically, I think I have, the pack here I went to uh, the store and I got these velcro uh, patches so this is a soft one and this is more of the soft one and these bottom ones are the rough ones so for like a couple dollars I bought these velcro patches and I put one on each corner and then obviously to the windshield and it has not fallen off again now a big reason why I'm giving you guys this review is because um, I wasn't so happy with it when I first had it because it kept falling off and I would just it would fall off while I was driving and then when I got a chance I'd stick it back up there. Well one time I was driving and it fell off and I got annoyed with it and I just threw it down here on the floor. Like I just threw it down here and left it down here and then the truck started to struggle more to start after sitting over the weekends which is originally the reason why I bought it. And I didn't really think it was making much of a difference when I first got it, but I just left it there. I thought it worked, you know, I would let it sit. I, I bought it, so I just used it, right? Well, over weekends, I would start my truck and drive away and didn't think anything of it. Well, I left it down here on the floor for a couple weeks and I started to notice that on Mondays, it would struggle to start again. And I was like, man, I should put that charger back up and see if it makes a difference. Bought these Velcro patches, stuck this thing back up on the windshield, and sure enough, it starts back up again every Monday like normal as if it hasn't even been sitting over the weekend. So that being said, overall review of it, it works pretty good. You just have to buy these Velcro patches, okay? That's getting straight to the point with you guys. Uh, I honestly recommend it. Now, this is a 3-watt trickle charger, again, from Amazon. When I bought it, I believe it was $25. Um, last time I checked, it was 25. I just checked again before doing this video and it was like 30. Uh, the price probably goes up and down. Hopefully it goes back down to 25 if you wanna get it. And that, that's the three watt. Now they do have a five watt for $35. So if it's $30 for the three watt that I got, I would recommend probably spending 35 for the five watt. Man, my glasses are fogging up. Um, but yeah, so 3 watt or 5 watt, 25 or 30 to $35. Now let me show you guys how I have it routed. I simply ran the wiring um, across here and tucked it back in here underneath this dash. You can get your finger in there and tuck it. I ran it down through here, tucked in here, and then I went up into behind the glove box. I think I actually had pulled the glove box down and fed it in through behind the glove box back out here out the other side of the glove box here is the connection point now it has this because you can unplug this and actually put the alligator clamps on it and run it straight to your battery um, this just has a 12 volt plug in it so it's just plugged directly into my 12 volt you know my cigarette lighter plugged uh, power outlet one there and i have one here so it's just plugged into that and like i said um, i have this you know, we have the, I don't know what these things are, seven threes have, but I hook, hook it on that, run it through my glove box and up. And then, like I said, these little Velcro patches with those, it doesn't fall. Uh, like I said, the truck starts good sitting over the weekend, like no problem, like as if it wasn't even sitting. And again, only $25. So just wanted to tell you guys about that because I definitely do think it works. Um, some of you may uh, like have to plug your truck in over the weekend for it to start up good especially if you live in cold areas me i don't even have the option of plugging my truck in overnight i don't have the option of plugging my truck close enough to my garage 
uh, to plug it in so I never plug my truck and I never have once even plugged my truck in uh, into the little plug that it has in the front end um, so I use this solar power trickle charger and honestly it does work okay so again I just want to bring that information to you guys if any of you are interested in that if your truck struggles to start over the weekend $25 30 35 for the 5 watt um, I recommend it just want to give you guys that information if you are interested in it the link will be down below you can go to the video description and find the link to, uh, from Amazon uh, I'll also put it in the comments there so hope you guys enjoyed that hope I brought you guys some good value and uh, if you guys do get it let me know what you think about it uh, don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video subscribe if you're not already and I'll catch you guys on the next video